the D Las Vegas' Tiny TV on OC16. I love my coffee, you know that. I gotta get that shot. At Kai Coffee, let me center my camera, man. <laughs> hey, uh, welcome to the show. Wanna welcome a few brand new sponsors of mine. Uh, we're gonna feature them in just a bit. One is The Fish Market, and they're located in three locations, Kalihi, Wahiawa, and in Waipahu, the best part about it is there's a local cravings, another friend of mine, inside of each fish market. So the fish market all over the place and more local cravings too. Another sponsor is Brick Oven Pizza. Been around for 40 years already. I just came out of the rain. <laughs> Great place to hang out here. Raining, sunshine, whatever is another sponsor of mine that's been with me for a while now. It's been over a year. Kai Coffee. I showed you how beautiful their coffee looks. Now they got more than just coffee. They've got sandwiches, they've got salads and soups, cookies, pastries. This is a bakery back here. We're gonna go visit and show all that. Uh, Sam is the owner here. We're gonna talk to him and just show you why there's a better place to have coffee than just the other one that you smell that's kind of burnt out like. <laughs> this is the one. There's one in Waikiki in the Hyatt Regency and this one right downtown on King and Alakea. You can see it's raining outside again and it's just the perfect place to come hide or hang out during lunch. Any kind of weather once again, but uh, Kai Coffee is here right in downtown. Club Sandwich is what we're looking at. That's uh, so, so awesome. Join the club. Let's go talk to Sam and, and tell you more about Kai Coffee. I've seen this guy. Uh, he's sitting here for a while. How's it going? Do you mind telling me why you like Kai Coffee? Well, I love Kai Coffee. I, I moved here about a year ago, and I love the convenient location right here in downtown and the great atmosphere and the folks and, well, especially the coffee. I just, I just started drinking coffee about a couple months ago, and I moved to the night shift, and so I, I think they make the best cup here, by far. Well, you're far a, a nurse, so you got to have coffee. What do you order? Uh, normally, I like my coffee just straight black, and I add a little bit of cream on it, and it's, it's Wait, perfect well, that way. You're, you're from the mainland, right? That's right. Yep, Chicago. Okay. Is this like some of the best coffee you've had ever? Well, as I said, I'm, I'm just trying to tune my taste at this point, but I think they make the best the best, best cup of coffee, and I've only been drinking for about a month now, but I've been around the block now a few times. Hi, what did you come to Kai Coffee for? Oh, I just came to pick up a couple of desserts for my sister and I. <laughs> <laughs> well, how'd you like the, the case there with all the desserts? It's more than coffee here, huh? Yeah, their coffee is really good, but I love their sandwiches and their desserts. Uh, and there's a lot. They bake it right here, you know. I know, and this one is the um, the Hawaiian bread, oh. which has pineapple and coconut in it. All right, yeah. well, enjoy. Thank you. Okay. Kai coffee is for everybody. Hey, how's it, Sam? How's it going after a year of business? Yeah, how's it going? That's uh, awesome. Would, would you say, you, in your wildest dreams, you, you knew it'd be so successful in this area? You know, I... I, I really I felt confident when we, when we opened our shop down here that we would have a good following just because we I understand the demographic down here and I think it's all about kind of building a relationship and uh, yeah it's it's really it's surpassed what we think yeah for sure now I wanted to show off more than just the coffee because last time you know it was Kai coffee and and, and we can brag because it is let, let's say first of all I heard you telling one of the customers it's freshly roasted weekly yeah we roast uh, Monday and Tuesday um, it's you know it's it's important where you source your coffee, so we source excellent coffee, fresh roasted, and then really just the preparation as well is really important. We you know we weigh out all of our espresso shots. I know some people think that's kind of wild, but we weigh out our shots. We the dimensions, you know, clean water. We have a really excellent filtration system. Reverse osmosis is like the cleanest you can get the water. So you want to really want to brew coffee with clean water as well. So a lot of different components go into making a great cup, but those are the those are the main ones. I'm into the food. I love the sandwiches that you added, and, and of course the pastries. Tell us about the sandwiches first. Yeah, uh, you know my my lovely wife Natalie, who's actually working hard back there. I think she she's uh, she she made um, she kind of made up the menu. And, uh, you know, we do our, our bread from scratch. We have an awesome pastry chef, Antonio, but we're doing our ciabatta and focaccia from scratch. Um, 
delicious local local locally sourced meats um those, and they're just killing it we're selling a lot in waikiki a lot here as well and uh, next up the pastries yeah um you know we're known for our our scones we have we have uh three different scones that we rotate through we got a raspberry almond blueberry cream cheese and a blackberry lemon that do awesome uh, our banana bread and we have a hawaiian bread now it's a mango pineapple bread that's delicious um so i mean we're just kind of you know we we, we kind of we do what the we, we do what the guests like people come in and give us good feedback and we try to just continue to expand and, and do what the guest likes now as far as the waikiki location i mean that's a different clientele but uh, i mean they got the same thing if we go over there they got food as well pastries absolutely every morning we're here 4 30 a.m uh, bringing it from here to there. Our bakery's right in the back here, so make it make it every fresh every day. Take it down there, and we got an oven down there as well, so uh, we get we can we can toast and heat and all that stuff down there. But yeah, all the the same menu down in Waikiki. And the hours here downtown? Uh, we're open six six a.m. to four p.m. We're actually one of the cool things coming up soon sooner than later. I hope uh, is we're adding beer and wine. So we're, we're in the process of getting the license for that. So that's going to be happening hopefully in the next month. Um, but we're just going to do, I'm putting a couple of taps back there. We're going to do a couple of local beers. And, um, and then just a, a selection of uh, red and white wine, sparkling wine. Um, and probably we'll extend the hours, you know, more of a Pauhana kind of uh, style. Not, not too late, like 7, 8 o'clock maybe. Uh, great place to sit down, obviously. But oh, yeah. Um, yeah, nice to have a, a beer, a glass of wine after work. That's our goal. There's nothing really in this immediate area to to get uh, to get beer and wine. So, Pauhana oh, after work, or they can catch the bus and come down. Yeah. But uh, that'll make you stand out than the other places. Well, I always said I like the coffee better, but again, it, it'll be something added. I don't know another coffee shop that has that. Yeah, I don't. I don't either. I think we'll be the first for sure. Now you guys know why I hang out here all the time. It's Kai Coffee, Aloha, in every cup. See, now you know why I love this place. I mean, they have everything, not just great coffee and the food, the people and the family atmosphere. Yeah, family. The place is new, the baby is new. That's little EJ, just popped out this year. Pop, popped out of the oven as well here in the bakery at Kai Coffee. So Sam and Nat Suter, uh, happy. We're happy, I'm happy. Everybody loves Kai Coffee. Rain, sleet, or snow, we're gonna come out to Kai Coffee downtown. It's right here on the corner of King and Alakea. Look for Kai Coffee. Enjoy the rest of the show on the D Las Vegas' Tiny TV on OC16.